way! Out of my way! Come on, Charles! I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone <laughs> can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man, I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey! hey there he is! Watch where you're going! Take it easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy or punch him? Huh? Oh, <laughs> and we have our answer! <laughs>
I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. Well, well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! <laughs> Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. Get it, boy. Yeah. I don't think you should just be wandering around here, friend. Careful, big man. Not a thing happens around here without an O'Driscoll saying so. Right! You're going down. You barely touched me. May you be a lesson to any That's it. that comes at the
I'm choking? Find yourself, partner. Oh. Come on, Try to remember what really happened at Sylvia's saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's Who's history. your friend there? Ha! Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Luzi Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. 
I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win, freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm gonna write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. Okay. Then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it, and, well... There's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity... Shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some... Sad, deluded fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. It does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. Yep. If you would give me a minute, please. I don't even want to know where that money came from. So that train that got robbed up in the Grizzlies had Mr. Cornwall's car on it, apparently. Thanks, bitch. Sorry. I never hurt anyone. 